Have you ever known that something was bad for you but did it anyway? You feel that knot of guilt in your stomach? That little voice telling you that you know better. Or maybe you preach about one thing but practice another. That feeling of mental friction? That's not just guilt. It's a powerful psychological phenomenon known as cognitive dissonance. At its core, cognitive dissonance is the deep discomfort we feel when our beliefs and actions don't line up. It's the smoker who knows cigarettes are lethal, or the environmentalist who drives a gas-guzzling car. Your brain is a finely tuned machine that craves consistency, and when it finds these two opposing ideas, it sends out a massive distress signal. So, how do we get rid of that uncomfortable feeling? We're so motivated to restore harmony that we'll do almost anything. There are three ways we resolve this mental tug of war. The first is the hardest. You can simply change your behavior to match your beliefs. The smoker quits, the procrastinator starts working. But more often than not, we take a different path. We change our beliefs to justify our behavior. The smoker might say, well, the research is probably overblown, or I'm going to die of something anyway. We're not lying to others, we're lying to ourselves to feel better. The third and most common strategy is to add new beliefs to rationalize our actions. This is where we create a mental story to bridge the gap. The person who wants to be healthy might say, I've been so good all week, I deserve this pizza. Understanding this powerful force helps us see why people cling so tightly to their decisions, and it gives you a lens to understand yourself and the choices you make every single day.